Reception time. Woo -hoo. Oh, yeah. Going we out to it. getting what? Champagne? Champagne. We're getting some I champagne. The, I think the wine's in the refrigerator. Yeah, haven't broken that out yet. Oh, Going to get some champagne. Oh, the cork opener thing. Who has that? Somebody has to. Somebody We're going to find a cork to. opener. We're going to break into that. Trevor's going to be taking me home pretty drunk. I'm He's not, not going to be having it. about it. Because he doesn't feel very good. Why does he? Oh, we have back surgery. Yeah, because it is back and surgery. And he won't let you forget. Yeah. Because he feels bad. But oh well. <laughs> Kelsey and I are gonna start drinking again. Woo woo! See if we can get party. See, All not right. too much spilled out. Yeah. Except right here. Yeah. Party time. All right. More B-roll later. Bye guys. Yeah. Okay, um, did you guys like it? We're good? Yeah, we're good. It smells a lot stronger than it tastes. Okay, I don't know what you're doing, but okay. Uh, <laughs> just... <laughs> Her look of confusion. Oh, that's sick. Now you know where I am. everybody this is Elizabeth Hi. and I was supposed to do this before the wedding happened on Saturday and I didn't because I failed life <laughs> no you don't JJ so there's that all right so here's an update about what's been going on so on Friday we went and had the rehearsal dinner and we decorated for the wedding. And it was cray cray. Kind of nobody knew what was going on. It was great. Beautiful wedding, beautiful. She made an absolutely beautiful bride. It was also beautiful. Um, um, she tried to marry him early. We were all ready by two and she was like, let's go. Let's get this wedding going. I'm like, your guests aren't here, we can't go. Update with Trevor's surgery. Um, he's still having some pain with it and stuff. Wait, Trevor had a surgery? Still trying to figure out what's going on money-wise um, to get reimbursed. We are not filing tomorrow at that court date to get reimbursed. I just had surgery on Monday. On my neck. Uh, ne ne I don't know what I was saying. Her there. gums. On my mouth. On my gums. Mm, look at all them beautiful teeth. Look at that. that. Yeah. That's more teeth than I've ever had in my life showing. Um, I was on a liquid diet for two days. It sucked. I'm just now moving to solid food. All I can have is like mashed potatoes and cottage cheese and stuff like that. So I'm not complaining about the mashed potatoes because you know, potatoes are life. See you guys next time. Toodles. Hey. Everyone, oh god, what happened to my nose? Um, I just got done watching Joker. It was an okay film. It was a little bit of a slow pacing movie. But the main thing I want to talk to you guys is about this video. And how I'm sorry that I just, I'm not as vloggy in this video. Or as talkative. Um, kind of did the math and it, it feels like after being up for about 8 hours... I start getting a headache and getting extremely exhausted, and it's been about eight hours today. Uh, that's unusual for me. I usually have a hard time sleeping, but now I just like I constantly just want to go to sleep. You know, I got one more day off before I go back to work. Smash up bell icon would be much appreciated, and I'll catch you in the uh, next whatever I film.
technically I still need to transport some more footage so this is going to be kind of out of order for me not really for you guys but uh, I still need to get the footage from JC hopefully she's vlogged something like actually said something she says she recorded some stuff from the wedding um, she's asleep right now wedding was excruciating for me yeah, watching someone else film the wedding kind of ate me up inside festival was pretty cool uh, I couldn't record in there people were being pointed out for recording in there because they explicitly did not want that at the moments where I had to wait it was excruciatingly, excruciatingly hard because that was I believe the day after my procedure if not the day after that it was pretty recent for my procedure and I'm still in pain uh, from after the procedure and this is like a week later but it was extremely hard for me to keep up my head and that would give me a headache and it would kind of make me feel woozy in the stomach and I feel like I was on the verge of passing out a lot. Everything to do with the music artists has gone down the chute. We got in a little argument about me not taking things serious and he doesn't take me serious to begin with so I know as a beginning filmmaker you should um, as many free jobs as possible and such but I'm pretty sure he pays a music mixer and I've grown up with him and I've done three or four music videos for him. Like, when is, when is enough? You know, um, he always says that he'll pay me a friendship and usually that's like a bag of chips and maybe a drink at the gas station, you know? I put up with it because I enjoyed the end product. The only real big downside to getting paid is you kind of put on the spot, you have like a deadline and you expectations to meet. I did have to still meet them, but I didn't, you know. Sometimes my best wasn't good enough for him. Like in this case. But she would think he would have had some understanding after uh, my procedure. Already on the verge of breaking down uh, at my job and such. I just didn't know if I could handle it. Sorry for getting all dark on you guys. Um, please smash that bell icon. Hopefully the next video I do, I will have some fog fluid because uh, my mom gave me my Christmas present early, which was a fog machine, which was pretty cool. And I thought I had some fog fluid, but I must have thrown it out with the old fog machine that stopped working. But yeah, see you guys later.